Welcome back for some more Fate Grand Order Cosmos in the Lost Belt. We're doing more interludes because uh, we have time, and that's the good thing. Uh, also, the premiere of the final Lost Belt part went up, and I got to see people making fun of me, not knowing what an Oort Cloud is. Well, I'm sorry, I didn't live in a country where they just teach you random frickin' information in school. Yeah, everything I learned is practical knowledge. Well, why would they ever teach about North Cloud? They just... Right? So, I now know. Don't worry, I've been told and told and told. So we're all good on that knowledge front. Also, uh, I did the new rank up quest which i completely missed for um uh summer the the bunny bunny ruler pen dragon because uh now royal card b is freaking insane so it used to just be redistribute cards and increase critical strength not bad it's pretty good but now you apply a state where a command card becomes unselectable for an ally and i thought to myself does that just mean like it is that like a nerf? Does that mean like when you put it, it makes them like grayed out? No. When it says unselect, it, they, they shouldn't say unselectable. It should say doesn't appear in your hand. Because you can literally say, I don't want this character's card being in my redistributed cards. So you get mixing from the other two, which uh, is incredibly broken. Because now you can guarantee Brave Chains. Also, it also gives Noble Phantasm gain up for one turn. It is so crazy. And you mix that now with the, the Locking Moon from Summer BB. Holy crap. Holy crap. Also, I needed to use some uh, some just single... I used two single heals to do the, the final big money quest there. All I needed was just heals, didn't use a full revive. But, uh, okay, we are going on to, again, continue through as many of the interludes as we can, right? Popping on through them. So, let's follow from Dom Rémy to Van Couleur to La Charité to Gérard to Lyon, and we will stop out at Marseille to check out Saint and the Dragon and Sea. Saint of the Dragon and Sea. Okay, okay. Um, I'm gonna show off how freaking cool this is. Okay, so we're gonna have you. We're gonna have... Uh... You, you, right there. And, okay. In addition, we want one that gives C stars, because that's something we can do. Right? Give a bunch of C stars as we continue. Um, we'll go with this. And we'll go with... Because the thing is, it increases your crit rate, right? So this setup might be freaking insane. Uh, and we're going to, because I still want to get you leveled up. So we're going to go with Archios and switch this over to the, uh, the bond up instead. So let's go to the bond up. Yeah, as I said, I, I picked up these just to have at least a single copy. Um, and then finally, as for you, I mean, I don't know, man. Give this to you for a bit more bond up, why not? Sure. Um, okay. Oh, and I guess we can give, can we give this to you? Yeah, cool, even more. Awesome. So, let's play around with this, because I feel this will be utterly broken. I'm so, I'm just, I want to try, I didn't, I didn't try them both out. I just tried it with the one. A normal. Yes, 
the kind of normal girl you'd find in any town. I lived happily with my little sister and brother, even though we quarreled from time to time. I was born in Bethany and raised in the same town. I thought that I'd live my life the same as everyone else. It is worth mentioning that she did go to France in her legend, so it makes sense why she's here. No, actually, how shall I put it? Perhaps I never even thought about the future. Because I was always busy. What should we have for dinner tonight? What would tomorrow's weather be? I was always running around, even when he was there. It's Jesus Cristo. While my sister listened to his words, all I ever did was worry about making guests feel welcomed. Martha, you were a girl who put her family first. I think that's admirable. You're naturally friendly. I wonder about that. Aren't you disappointed? Saints whom people love always seem to shine. Yes, like Jean d'Arc. Both Sean and you seem like shining saints to me. In loving people, you become the, you became their hope. That's the sort of woman you are. That's why I think you equally deserve to be called saints. Thank you, Mash Curia Light. Uh, don't mention it. Uh, sorry to interrupt, but I'm detecting multiple magical signatures in the sea ahead. Just as Martha feared, there's some sort of distortion on the Marseille coast as it's being repaired. Doctor, do we need to dive under the sea? I doubt it. If push comes to shove, my Tarrasque will... Uh, don't need to put a French accent to that, I guess. We'll guide the swarm to the shore. Swarm? Ooh! Guide? Wait, is, is Fu there with you? Yes, that's a swarm without a doubt. My trait allows me to accurately detect that. A swarm of an incomplete subspecies of dragon. Something that shouldn't be in this area of the 15th century. Yeah! That's the roar of a wyvern. I see. As expected of the Saint of Dragons, you sense the swarm of wyvern wyverns go. So is she the Saint of Dragons? Well, I guess George, Georgios, is a dragon slayer. Martha called a Tarasque. This is nothing. The coast was once part of the Tarasque's domain. Born of Leviathan, created by God on the fifth day, he is a fierce monster that many a brave man tried to slay. Now the Tarask exists within me, the sad dragon who knows not of love. Go now, Tarask, wielding a burning heat equal to the sun. Grant momentary peace to these creatures made pitiful by the moment of their birth. St. Martha's magical energy is rising. Is, is this turning into a battle of kaiju Tarask versus wyvern army? That sounds like a title that would be a kaiju film. The wyvern swarm is approaching. Time for battle, senpai. Okay, let's do this. So yeah, I want to test out, test this out, see how good it can be with uh, with locking them in. So like for instance here, right? If I want, I could go. Okay, so shuffle, and I don't want, let's say, you, right? So she's excluded, meaning that look at this, I get a full combo with you, and I can go lock that in now, right? And so now I can go one, two, I mean, I could do a brave combo, but I want to kill them all, right? But the fact that now I have set brave combo for that many turns and I get a bunch of stars, I get a bunch of stars. And especially if I give it to someone who gets a high rate of getting the stars, right? Oh my God, this is freaking insane. This is the most insane, I think, synergy and they're two summer servants right so like it works mind you it's only three turns but damn what a three turns it is right all right just deal with you there we go like what a solid three turns yeah so it's gone now and what's your cooldown on it four turns that's not bad at all that is shockingly good in my eyes. Yeah, no, I'm, I'm, I like that. That is a huge buff. That might be one of the biggest buffs I think I've seen. And like, so here's the thing. With the Noble Phantasm gain, if I were to get like, like if I were to get a character who gets three blue cards, 
and can do that with the gain up and all that. Like, bro, I could do so many Noble Phantasms. That plus Summer Mordred? Insane. Insane. All right. Uh, crit Strength. Don't really need that. Gauge. Nope. Don't really need that. Okay. So let's just go. One, two, three. Yeah, this is... This is a combo. Holy crap. Oh, I gotta talk over this because it's the song from the thing that gets copyrighted, so I gotta talk so that they don't detect it until you tell that this is not the song. Okay, thank you very much. Goodbye. Cool. Always forget about that. Okay, so... God, I don't even... I, have, I think I have a single pixel. Is this single pixel there? It's ridiculous. That's ridiculous. All right. Well, uh, let's grab. Let's see here. Whom else can we grab? I mean, I could grab our own. Mar well, no, she's not an assassin, so that wouldn't really work. Um, let's go your critman critter. So we'll go with that. Battle's over. No, more are coming. Confirming a trailing swarm. I forgot I should bring up the uh, the list of FGO interlude dates. I forgot I should bring that up so I can check when they're out. So this one here is a... Right, if we take a look. Martha. Uh, this is a release one. Forming a trailing swarm. There's just no end to them. This is annoying. Huh? Huh? Woo woo! Martha, did you just... Did something happen, everyone? Come on, let's hang on a little longer. Fight! Fight! So she, she lets down the facade, right? Uh, right. We're gonna continue the battle. Send by your orders, please. Yeah, like, she's all like, I'm, I'm a holy saint. But we know she's actually, like, super not that. Okay, so let us beat this up. But again, I'm I'm playing around with 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 these here, seeing how I could work them out. So again, I want to go shuffle without you because honestly, you don't have a type of upgrade. So I mean, you're fine, but you're not as good. I'm, okay, so yeah, this is the downside: is we didn't get that many there, but we got a lot of red. We got a lot of red on you. So I could go like one, two, three, right? And do big damage or not. Well, that's fine, but we'll get a ton of stars this turn. Say so even just like 30 stars. That's redonk, man. One, I'm going to do the green to get some more stars. I'm going to go one. That'll kill for sure. Then two, three. Okay. Yep. All right, more stars. Oh, this is a good strat. Oh, I like it. Mind you, again, it only works for a certain number of turns. Uh, actually, let's go... Yeah, let's go one, two, three. That's fine. But dang, don't it work good. Okay. So that's over now, which is fine, because, like, you still get a lot of good stuff after it. Right? Okay, and let's finish this. Get you your meter. Get some stars. I just love him just punching the crap out of a wyvern okay um we can go with that we can go let's go one actually you have crit up too so yeah let's go one and then let's just do a bunch to you yeah so we're gonna go because that'll kill you almost assuredly does this do more? 
increase crit strength. Don't really need that. Okay, so yeah, we'll go one, two, three. That'll kill one for sure, and then we'll move on to the second. Cool, cool, cool. And how much is going to do? Not nearly as much as I expected, honestly. Okay. Yeah, no, uh, no type advantage, so that's why it definitely didn't do that much. Alright. No, but this strat is wild. Honestly, put in, if I put in another character who does crazy crits, like Emya, oh my god, Emya could be a beast like this. Oh, I kind of, I have him in my party, he's literally there. I want to, tr oh, I want to try that out. I want to try that. I confirm the enemy is completely destroyed. We did it, Senpai. <laughs> You're no match for us, lizards. Did those mere wyverns hope to best me in the Tarask? They're just peeping hatchlings fresh from their eggs. Your holiness? And thus return the poor souls who know not of love. God's love is equal. Yes, in the past, the Tarask was treated the same. Yeah, yeah. When dragons choose slaughter and refuse to listen, the use of force is the only way. Oh, terrible. I mean, a total respect, Your Holiness. St. Martha may be a saint, but she's also an extremely gifted dragon slayer, isn't she? I see that now. Senpai, she'll be a very dependable servant. Oh, you're too kind. I'm just... Just a magnificent dragon slayer. Huh? She called herself a dragon slayer? Foo, 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 foo. And that, my friends, is another early interlude. Just give me the... Give me the same course and let's go. Oh, it's been updated. What do we got with her? For St. Martha, there is nothing to wish for with the grail that's not of the Messiah. Oh. As she, as always, she remains a servant even after being materialized, a saint even after being materialized as a servant. She will gladly help her master as long as they continue to walk the path of righteousness. Interesting. Interesting. Okay, cool. Does, does Jesus even get named here? Does, does Jesus get a name? Oh yeah, no, the Messiah. Th they always say the Messiah. They never say Jesus. Martha, the desired saint. We'll go to that when it comes up. Because, well, nah, we'll, we'll pop that. Where is it? We'll do it. We'll, we'll get it out of the way. All right, do them both. Uh, so let's go to interlude. We need to find where hers is. Let's see here. Might as well clear it. The Desired Saint. Oh, it's now here. Okay. Yeah, I want to try. No, he's not. Calm down, Gilly. He's not here yet. I know you. Gilly was in our Discord and he's had a Charlemagne profile picture for like two years. And we keep saying like, and literally when we got like the silhouette, he's like, I'm not huffing the copium. I'm, I'm not going to believe it till I see it. And he finally got it. Um, let's just, yeah, let's just get Bond up. And I want to try this. And let's give you... So again, let's go with you. We want Sea Star Gather up. Right? Let's see here. What do we got? Sea Star Gather rate by 200% Noble Phantasm Strength. Okay. That's not bad. That's not bad. In fact, is that kind of like Noble Phantasm gain? I think I'd prefer the strength. Okay. Or we could just get more stars. Because honestly, if we get enough, if we just get enough, then we're good, right? Because we could go, let's see here, gain four stars, gain up 3% per turn. No. Strength up. Let's see. What's another good one? Ah, crit strength up. Oh boy, that's a good one. Okay, let's let's see how silly this can get. I'm curious. All right. I know we're not doing tight matchups, but I'm just trying stuff. Oh, 
Oh. Yes, Fu, but please be quiet for now. Martha, is something bothering you? Yes, Martha's on edge, isn't she? Ever since we came to this era. There's something wrong in ancient Rome in the second singularity. It was her, it was Martha who told us that. I assume it's not good news. Could it be related to the dragons again? If so, that's odd. Wasn't she all excited about it before? Maybe it's personal this- Oh, wait. Oh, is she- Wait. Wait, if she's- If this is the era where all the Roman emperors are here, is she gonna look for Pontius Pilate? Wait, was Pontius Pilate an emperor? Uh... Fifth gov- No, he was a governor. He was under Tiberius. Okay, okay. Normally, it's normally not possible because all souls are under God's divine grace. Wandering the earth, not going to either heaven or hell. Such acts are not allowed. I mean, all of the original sins have already... What are you talking about? The souls... Oh, I detect magical energy reaction. A large amount, dead ahead. <laughs> Get it, dead? Based on the signature pattern, ghosts are coming. Be careful. Mash, prepare for battle. Yes, master. Damn. Huh? Damn! A saint said damn? Uh, d did I say something wrong? I said it's freaking impossible. What's with that stupid amount? I thought I said all souls that are to God's divine grace. Foo! Martha! So I didn't imagine it last time. Something's wrong with Martha. Yeah, you're right. You're definitely right. Souls wandering the earth is definitely normally not possible. Sending them back to God's grace, yes, but ghost-type monsters, really? They only exist because of magecraft. They aren't naturally generated. In other words, they aren't part of nature. But hold on, if that's the case, then heroic spirits... Oh. I told you. This is freaking impossible. Why did they appear before us, especially before me? St. Martha's magical energy level is rising. Senpai, she's going to unleash your noble phantasm. Without the master's order, she's pissed. Oh no, Tanner. Uh, with Kaiju to rask on the rampage, Rome is done for. Get her under control t to battle. Eliminate those ghosts as soon as you can. Is that clear? Mash, prepare for battle, I guess. Yes, Master. What is she talking about? What is she talking about? It's kind of nice getting some of this characterization for this, you know, servants that I just see it in, like, events and stuff. Okay, let's... Oh my god, look at this hand already. Holy crap. Wait, hold up. Nah, we'll do it. Okay, so then we'll go with... We don't want any of you. Okay. Crit up, gain up. Nice. Triple. I mean, it's, it's no red, but... But... Okay, we're gonna lock in. Right? And let's go... So this is the drop rate and crit strength. Um, yeah, let's get some drop rate up. Okay. And let's go one, two, three. Give it a shot. I want to see these, these insane numbers. Okay. 52. Holy moly, that's more than enough, huh? Okay, so let's go with... So I don't, I, I mean, I don't want to necessarily hit you there. So we'll get you then after to switch to the next target. And then we'll go uh, this with you. Okay. How much are you going to do? A lot. A lot. Good. It's almost better to save it till the end, though, for sure. Right? Okay. Oh man, though. Oh man, that's a lot. Now imagining it was Super Orion, and that's... I can't even, like, imagine that one. That'd be insane. Okay, so let's go one, two, three. Okay. All right, and let's go one, two, three. Nice amount. 
You're done. Okay. No, my MP! No, my MP! And... I mean, like, bro. How much do you need? You need just one more turn? Let's just pop this on you. Do extra stuff. One, two, three. Okay. Yeah, wow, this is not bad. For no type matchup whatsoever, that ain't bad at all. Let's go one, two, three to get some stars. Not that we need a ton more, but still. God, I could I could even probably put a berserker in the middle and do some insane stuff, huh? Alright, so let's start with... Oh my god, never mind. Let's do this. Let's go with... Let's go with... Uh, get rid of you. Crit up. Lock the cards. Gain C-stars. Get crit up. Okay, so I'm gonna go... I'm gonna go... One... Let's go with this one. And then three to probably move on to the other one. Okay. Okay, didn't do nearly as much as I expected, actually. It's still doing good. Yeah. No, no type matchups means that this is a lot weaker than it could be. But, regardless, this strategy is crazy based. Alright. Like, look at that. Oh, so good. This could honestly become my go-to thing for just... I just want to play, right? Where it's just like, yeah, just, just you know, have him destroy these. And because and, those, those other two don't have any weaknesses, right? Like, she has specifically, she's strong against everything. And Moon Cancer, we're not going to be fighting anything that goes hard against her. So it's like, dang, dang, that's amazing. All right. Uh, honestly, let's go... Yeah, I'm just gonna keep getting you to get some more bond up, because why not? And let's switch you out, then, with, uh, someone who's real strong against all of you. So let's go with, uh, with you. Yeah. Okay. All right. And let's save it till the end this time. Also, I, I can give them C-stars whenever, thanks to my Mystic Code there. Hostel's destroyed. The battle's over, Senpai. They should put Martha back to her usual quiet self. Huh? Ooh. If she's not back to normal, then um, right, of course. I've got a you two. There's still something there. Rather, she's here because she sensed this. Something much larger than a mere ghost. Yes, this is the sixth imaginary element. Its true nature is unknown, but at the very least, its magical energy indicates it's is that I sends it too senpai prepare for battle Woo! what do you mean this the what don't let martha go out it's likely she'll unleash the true name of her noble phantasm like before at any rate your opponent is picking up high level of magical energy it's definitely a demon tarask oh no tanner hurry we have to defeat the enemy and take control of saint martha mash prepare for battle Yes, Master, preparing for battle. Foo, 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 foo. Here we go. The sixth imaginary element. What are you talking about? Nasu, sixth imaginary element. What does that have to do with the demon? Oh, the sixth element is demon? What, really? Where, wait, wait, wait. Where is it? Okay, so... Sixth... The sixth imaginary element known as demon. Or daemon. Okay. 
is a force that reacts to the desire of humans and births demons out of their wishes. Huh. Okay. Interesting. How come I didn't know about that, really? Um, so again, we'll, we'll, we'll start with not using our stuff right away. We'll hold on to it. It's probably the better way. <laughs> All right. Slam you. Get you. Get some stars. Get a bunch of stars now. Okay. We can go one... Two, three. Big hit. Okay. That's so little damage. Okay. And you know what? I'm gonna go pop this. Get a few more so we can go hundo. Big damage. Even more. Nice. Good stuff. How many did that drop? Ten? Okay. Not bad. Not bad. And... Uh, do we want to do a full combo? Probably. Sure. I mean, we could do this to get even more on you. Why not? Sure. One, two, three. Let's see how much you do with this. Nice. Nice. Oh, yeah. Good stuff. Good, good, good. Okay, next set we got... Uh, let's go... One, two, three. These guys have a lot of HP, actually. For what is a release, like a release era interlude, right? These are, these are actually pretty beefy, all things considered. So I can't do anything with her, but that's fine, because we can go one, two, three. Wish that critted. Okay. And let's go. I'm just gonna go one, two, three on you to get as much as I can and do some big damage. I guess we could have killed because I would have just done barely over, huh? I thought I'd do a lot more. Again. Playing certain events and certain things has just ruined my perception of how much they do, right? Uh, you know what? Let's go one, two, three. Okay. I mean, it's not as good as just using a full party of actual servants, right? Ones that can do a lot of good with them. Um, so that is a thing to consider, right? Where it's not, it's definitely not as good as just actually fighting them as you're kind of intended with a party of ones that have the, you know, the type advantage. But, but, it's still pretty good, right? There's, there's some stuff you can definitely, some ideas you can do with this, I feel. There's some good stuff that, that this lays the groundwork for. Okay. Show me this demon. Is it going to be an actual demon, or is it going to be a ghost sprite, and it's going to be like, that's that's the opponent. Let's see. No, no, this is, this is, yep, yeah, we had a, a demon here. Okay. Okay, so, uh, let's go attack up on you. Let's go card shuffle to not feature the, well, I guess if we go with you, then if we get a bunch of BBs, and we can use hers to instead get big crits, but it doesn't matter, because we got that with you. Uh, let's lock in. 
The only thing is we have the... I, I don't want to use that because I could use that to get crits with her, but I don't want to in this case. Let's go with this on this. And let's go one, two... Actually, let's go two and then three to get some more stars to hopefully get a bigger one at the uh, next turn, too. This is an insane combo, though. Like, let's watch how quickly we can destroy this dude with just always having a full combo with one really good servant. Okay. God, and then if you upgrade the extra attack too? Frick, dude. That's crazy. So now... Pure hundreds. That's... That's in Mind you, we don't have any, you know, busters in there, but still. Oh, that is... That's some good stuff for real. Whoa. That strat's real good. Hey! 10 BB coins and some Saint Quartz. Don't mind if I do. That's because both of these girls are on my, like, um, ember grinding team that I just make a macro for that just auto grinds. So they, they get it quite fast. For heaven's sake. Haven't we have enough, tr haven't we enough trials to face? Just look at this world. Isn't it obvious? There's no place for anyone who can't see that. May that be men or demons. Back to hell with you. No matter what air it is, there's no place for demons. Because all original sins were carried away by him. Oh, that's why. Martha. All right, battle's over, and it looks like St. Martha's calm again. Woo! All's well that ends well. Wow, that was scary. Foo-foo! A demon possessing the power equal to a dragon is scary, but I think I'm more afraid of St. Martha, actually. Really, I'm really glad she didn't go berserk. Pardon? Did I do something? Thanks to you, we've driven off the lost souls and demon. All this, too, is God's will. Yes, in normal circumstances, my existence as a heroic spirit is unnatural. Even so, as long as I'm with you, those who strive to save the world. My momentary existence, my shallow resurrection. I believe all that has a purpose. Thank you, Tanner, Mashkirielite. No, St. Martha, thank you for lending us your assistance. Yeah, no, we'll be counting on you. Uh, more so in your ruler form, but... Yes. Huh? Did did she skip my name just now? I mean, you did nothing, bro. Woohoo! He did nothing. Which is, I mean, that's what he was in early FGO. It's, God, it's weird going back. It's weird going back. Uh, so, let's go back and see what else uh, is there for us in France. Alright, so, uh, we got here. Oh, we can head off to Bordeaux. Oh, oh I want to check this one out. Knight of Owner. So this one is... I feel like this one's got to be later, right? No, this was release. Okay. All right. Um, let's go with... Okay, yeah. We'll put you in the back. Let's... You know what? You know what? Let's do it. Let's do it. Let's put him in. Let's see what happens. Sea star crit strength. Yep. Let's go. Let's see how well this works. Interlude, Knight of Owner. I'm sure we're going to get amazing dialogue from him. Ah, this breeze certainly feels nice, doesn't it, Senpai? It sure does. By the way, I was wondering why you brought a berserker to such a peaceful picnic. Doctor, Lancelot may be a berserker, but I think if you talk to him, he'll understand. He's a reasonable berserker, so I think it's all right. A reasonable berserker. He couldn't be a berserker then, could he? To be honest, it seems that way. Like, out of all of them, I feel like he, yeah. he th He's the one that I would, like, if I was his master, I'd be fine around. There's a couple of Berserkers that I would greatly fear being around, but I feel like I could I could hang with, with Berserker a lot. Yes, he, he does seem to understand us. Who? I know it, he doesn't understand us. No, that's not it, Senpai. It's an enemy attack. Get behind me. I'll intercept the... Huh? Where's my shield? 
Sorry, I put our lunches on it. We were... Oh my god, wait, hold up. Hold the freaking phone. Is this joke foreshadowing the fact that it's the round table? Oh my god, that's brilliant. Oh, it still has our lunches on it. Senpai, watch out! <laughs> that's a lot. Use the chopsticks to stop the attack. That's amazing. That's pretty rad. So that's the skill of Knight of Owner. Bravo, Lancelot. Oh, and she doesn't even know that's her dad. Going out for a picnic with her dad, she doesn't even know. That's kind of sad. Well, kind of her dad. Not really, but... But those chopsticks won't hold out for long. Uh, I think we need to get Mash's shield. Just carefully move the lunch boxes. Foo! Huh? What do you find, Foo? That's a log. Well done, Foo. <laughs> Take it, Lancelot. <laughs> Well, just touching that log, he instantly transformed into a noble phantasm level weapon. Can we get a costume where he's just wielding a log? When, you, when they say log, I imagine it's something like thick, right? Like not long, but just a thick chunk of wood. So that is scarier than a long, like thinner thing. Getting hit with that is way scarier, man. All right, so let's just start with just getting some stuff here, killing these pretty low-level enemies. There we go. And now we have some more very low-level enemies. Okay. Do some of this. Okay. There we go. Okay, and our final opponent is, it's a dragon tooth warrior. Everyone be scared. Okay, so I'm going to say none of you. So let's see here. Oh, the eyes are glowing through there. Good. Look at that. Uh, we can go with lock the cards. We can go with get these on you. And this would be... Critical strength. Okay, so let's go. Yeah, let's get that on you. Okay, let's see. Let's see how much you can do. All right, let's see here. I'm curious. Oh yeah. Oh yeah. That's pretty good. That's pretty good. And what's his gather rate up like for this? Yeah. Bruh. Bruh. That's solid. That's real solid. This might be my go-to, like, using a Berserker kit, honestly. It's just real strong. Okay. Let's do that again. Yeah, let's do it again. Why not? It's working out good. Uh, what 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 level are you at for your? It's oh you're just you're going to get it in just a sec. You two are like synced up. Nice. They're still coming, senpai. Your orders. Lancelot, fresh log for you, buddy. Log. There you go, pal. Log, log. Big. It's hard. It's wood. Log, log. It's better than bad. It's good. I do kind of agree with people that it's a bit of a shame that we get... Like, like his Noble Phantasm being the crazy... Fr freaking, like, you know, the, 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 the bomber jet, right? Like, it's cool. It's cool. It, it is a super sick scene. And a nice reference to, of course, you know, him using it in Fate Zero. But at the same time, I feel like with how utterly insane his noble phantasm could be right when you know all the things he can do right the idea of everything around him becomes a weapon is so cool that you know anything he grabs so i feel like there could be more they could do but i at the same time it's almost too much where you can't necessarily 
be like, okay, well, he's gonna do this for an attack, because, you know, he would have to have a whole thing around him and grab something at random, and I don't know. I can So I can see where people are like, oh, it kind of sucks that it's the, the jet fighter again, but at the same time, it's like, what could you do that's not just... I don't know. Okay. Get that. Lock in. Get that. Get this. And let's go. One. Two. And then three to move on, hopefully. Oh, we didn't only didn't even need we didn't even need another, huh? Dang, okay. Okay, it's pretty good. Okay, it's pretty good. Good, 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 good. Nice. Last one versus Berserker. Are we going to be fighting? Is it going to be a, a, a battle against Sh Shadow Berserker lot? If so, that'd be kind of cool. It's the last wave of enemies. Lancelot, your log. Oh, it's bashed to bits. It's new log for you. <laughs> Brawl log! He seems upset. Master, it seems if he's had it with logs, and what's a real weapon? Uh, anything's a real weapon in your hands, buddy. Let's give him... Yo, let's give him, like, a scarf. Actually, wait. Remember when Emya took, like, the folded-up poster? When Shiro, he took the fold-up poster and reinforced it. That was kind of cool. That was kind of cool, right? I could see that. I could. I could see them doing something like that, right? Where it's like, give them that folded up, you know, piece of something, and that works. Yeah. I almost prefer it when he just has the the um the pipe rather than his weapon. I mean, it's cool. It's the Black Arendite, but you know, at the same time, it's just. The idea of just fighting with this, you know, pipe that you're you're powering up. It's pretty cool. I mean, it was cool when it was in near, right? Uh, let's go one. Yeah, look at this. Like, look how many stars we're getting, which is still giving, like, high amounts of sea star gather on him. Okay, so let's go... I mean, decent amount, right? Go with the drop rate up. So let's go one, two, three. Got a few extra. Nice. And by a few, I mean three. It's actually not a lot. Should probably up that. Oh, it's a chimera. Ooh, let's act scared. So, we're going to pop off you. Yeah. Oh, baby. Oh, baby. Oh, my goodness. Oh, okay. <sighs> you love to see it. You love to see it. I've never even seen him no scope. I've never seen him do that. That's rad. Wow. My man literally no scopes. All he's missing is the 360. Lancelot Gaming. <sighs> Somehow we fought them off. You were a great help, Lancelot. Knight of Owner. I see, but lo can logs and chopsticks be counted as weapons? I've heard of great swordsmen in ancient Japan who used chopsticks to defeat an insect like monster, so I don't think it's unusual. Is that a freaking Karate Kid reference? Or was that a reference to Musashi? Yes. Oh, really? But even then, they wouldn't work as weapons without Lancelot's unparalleled abilities. Wow, Musashi gets a reference real early. And then again, Musashi's like super famous, so. Brawr! What, another enemy attack? Or not? Is he communicating with us? I'm sure that's it. Don't you agree, senpai? Huh? Well... Brrr! Woo! 
Yeah, I, I gained Berserker Talk later. We don't have it just yet. We don't have that ability to, you know, understand random screaming. Uh, his profile's been updated. What do we have here? Losing his parents at a young age, he was raised by Nimui, the fairy of the lake, hence the nickname Knight of the Lake. After coming of age, he headed to the island of Britain and became Knight of the Round Table after meeting King Arthur. They say he was unparalleled in his bravery and chivalry. The result of his chivalrous spirit was that he fell for Queen Venevere, Quen Guinevere, rather. If the treachery against the king had quickly led to his ruin, he might have had salvation. However, since his bravery was peerless, the situation presented the worst possible outcome. A knight does not die empty-handed. That's cool. A noble phantasm gives the ability to turn whatever he holds into his own noble phantasm. Any weapon will become a D-ranked noble, uh, pseudo-noble phantasm. Eternal arms mastery, a skill which manifests when one's martial arts training reaches the state of invincible in that era. Uh, through perfect synchronization of the body, skill, and mind, he can unleash his full combat potential regardless of mental limitations. Due to his countless honors uh, granted to him and his own obsession with his regret, in particular the contradicting feelings of love and hate toward his king and queen, he will continue to be a prisoner to his madness. To pacify his anguish, the Black Knight will continue to fight in search of the one, a person who can give him peace. Oh, hey. For someone's glory. Alright. Oh, this is just a general one. Okay. Uh, let's, again, just stick with what we got, because it works. Okay. So... Let's go. Why not? Lancelot's face? Yeah, see, he's always wearing that helmet, right? Don't you want to see what's on? Oh, we're doing the Kakashi thing? He's probably quite handsome. Phew. You'll have to admit, Lancelot is the ideal image of a knight. He's the most popular heroic spirit among the ladies in this world. Huh, but... Oh, this is weird for her. How can we get his helmet off? Plan A! A slip of the hand during battle. Alright, let's give it a try. Now then, I'm gonna start the battle simulation program. Is everybody ready? I feel really bad about tricking him. Got a doc. I'm ready anytime. The enemy is a simulated servant used for training, so it's not dangerous. Don't worry. I'm gonna set the parameters at the highest, though. Let's begin, Master. Am I supposed to slip and pull his helmet off? Senpai, shh, shh. Mermit. <laughs> we literally said it out loud. Sometimes when you're in these situations, I literally like to just... To just act stupid, right? When there's no reason to not, let's just act dumb, yo. Like, there's times where it's like, oh man, I want to make sure that the story goes the right way. But then there's times where I'm like, no, let's just be dumb. Or is this just, like, pseudo-boss rush? Interesting. Um, let's do... Some of that. Stars on you, why not? We do do-do-do. Nice, nice. Yeah, let's go now. One, two, three to start. Okay. Golden rule. Oh, golden rule sucks when the opponent uses it, huh? We should actually probably just start using our strat now. Yeah, let's do it. Uh, let's go lock and we'll kill you because we buffed you there. Oh, bad hand. Well, that's fine. Um, lock that in. Okay. And let's go... One. Do we want this? Yes, because we got a green there. Okay. Some of that. So let's go... One. Two. Three. Okay. Good damage. Oh yeah, man's gonna get his noble phantasm next turn, so we gotta end this. Oh wait, there's a shadow servant. They don't have that, right? Uh, let's go one, two, three to get more and kill. Yeah, this will kill. Or not? What was with that damage, yo? Why'd that do so little? What? What? That seemed very off. Okay. 
Um, let's go green on you. Let's go one, two, three. That was very weird. Sadly, we can't go Skahawk uh, Berserker lot now, but oh well. All right, now we got Chew. Let's go with this. And let's go one, two, three. Just keep getting lots of stars. Okay. Nice crit miss. Love to see that. Um, We got a bunch on use. Let's do that. Do that too, just because why not? Get that buster up. Let's go one, two, three. Do some good damage. Nice stuff. Okay. Yeah, so Golden Rule isn't the best skill because I don't love no, no the Noble Phantasm gain ones. It's like, it just doesn't feel super useful. But like, when you have... When you have the opponent use it, they just get an extra charge, which sucks. Alright. And... Who do we have to end it? Roma! So, let's go with... Let's see here. Um, How much are you going to get? Enough. Okay, then, you know what? Sure, we'll do this. Why not? Let's do a triple phantasm then. Just do a bunch. So let's go... What does your overcharge do again? I always forget. Damage cut overcharge? Sure, why not? We'll do that. Why not? Might as well get it done. These are pretty small numbers. These guys must have some jacked up defense, I feel. I feel like these guys got some crazy stuff going on with their defense. It's weird. Doesn't feel like I'm doing enough damage. Cool. Alright, so let's do, let's see here, I'm not going to worry about that, um, or I mean I guess I could if I lock, if I shuffle and say I don't want any of yours because you have like the least attack really, so let's see here, who do we get, uh, we got you, so let's lock that in, right, and let's do it with an attack boost on you, especially because you got your fall going, so let's go one, two, three, That'll give you more next turn as well. Like, it at least leads to good continual damage, for sure, right? God, you're just gonna keep healing, huh? We'll even give that to you, because why not? You got a crit on you there. Let's go one, two, three. Get some more of that. Big crit. Nice. Oh, that's a big crit. So close. You're gonna say, are you gonna try to heal? The answer is no. Let's just finish this. Don't need to use a Noble Phantasm. I do wish whenever you do like a big combo with a but with a with a single servant over and over i wish you got the combo counter like the noble phantasm one right just so you can see how much they're doing that'd be nice that'd be real nice
All right, let's finish this one off. Oh, okay. You know what? Let's go with... Yeah, let's let's actually use a proper team here. Uh, so let's go with... Let's see here. You're actually really strong, so we can go with that. Yeah, we'll pop you in, and then you can come in afterwards in case you're needed. Okay. Brrr. Uh, that was excellent. It's no good. He doesn't leave any openings during or after battle. He truly is a knight of the lake. Is he really under madness enhancement? Uh, that must be his famous eternal arms mastery. Even under madness enhancement, his combat skills, skills will never deteriorate. We're not through yet. Don't give up, Mash. The next Shadow Servant, Servant, Shadow Servant will be incredible. I'm gonna rig the settings. Even the Knight of the Lake won't be able to... Oops. Um, Doctor, what is this? Sorry, I messed up. I might have summoned an extremely powerful Mock Servant. Oopsie daisy? Oopsie daisy my butt. Foo. Oh, just FYI, this Shadow Servant might cost you your lives. Doctor, do your best. I'll make you pay for this later, got it? Anyway, let's take care of this Lancelot. Who could it be? Archer. Tristan wasn't available at this point, right? No. Maybe it's just Emya. No, I think it would show him. Hmm. Hmm. Maybe it's just an unrelated one that they threw in just because they needed another one. Oh, it's oh, it's Gil. Okay, sure, sure, sure. All right. Um, so let's do uh sh shuffle, and we don't want that. Okay, and let's go. Nice, we got a full thing. Lock it there. Let's go gain some stars, even for this first one, right? Get going. Gain that buster up. Stop your noble phantasm. Right, seal that. Get that burst of flame. Buster up, strength up. Get your... Oh, I thought you'd have enough. Oh, no. I thought you... I swore you'd have enough. Okay, well, that's fine. I swore his, his one gave him enough, but maybe not that one. So that's fine. We'll go one, two, three to start. You'll get it next turn. And we should get a lot of stars next turn for crit strength up as well. Yeah, we lost a bunch of buffs there, sadly, because I thought we would have it all to burst it at once. But nope, that's fine. Fine by me, though. So let's go. Yeah, we got this. We got this. We'll go one, two, three. And that should honestly kill him in one. Which will make this easier than the last one, honestly. Bust resist down, and here we go. Ooh, that was a big hundred thousand on him. Wowie! Wow, wow, wow. And that wasn't even him fully buffed, huh? Yay, we completed 80 interludes, which is a lot, it feels like. I don't feel like we've done 80 of them. Right? That feels like a lot. One, just barely. Not really. He made that fight look like a walk in the park. The Knight of the Lake. What a guy. Ooh. So remind me why we're doing this. It's all because the doctor wanted to see Lancelot's face. That's why we... Uh, oops. Mash? I'm sorry. Come on, just show us. Don't make me use a command spell. Oh, Kachank. What? You're going to show us? Foo! What? All my effort was for nothing? But finally, we could see the Knight of the Lake's true face. <gasps> Whoa, what the... I don't know what to say. For some reason, even with his helmet off, it's a blur and I can't make out his features. Oh, really? Interesting. Huh. Show us your face! I get it. I think it's the effect of for someone's glory. The skill guy conceals a status and appearance, isn't it? But still, even this close with his helmet off, I can't see a thing. 
All this has made me so tired. Let's go back and eat. Yeah, let's. Well, talk about a waste of time. I think that's the right phrase for I mean, ignoring the ten sand quartz I'm getting. Don't talk like that, Doctor. Lancelot, please don't be offended. Someday we'll be able to see your real face, right? <sighs> yes, that's right. I have a feeling it will happen. Foo! Yeah, because, I mean, I feel like they absolutely had Saberlot planned right away, right? Right, yeah. Man, look how many look how many things we're getting. Look at this that we get. And I just completed the um the one for uh the rank ups. Right? I did 80 rank ups. Okay, so there's 180 interludes. Okay, so we're almost at least from this, according to this, about halfway there. Mind you, we don't have every servant, right? Um Okay. Nice, 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 nice. We're all, we're, we're working towards getting as much as we can for that one very important summon. Uh, all right, guys, thank you all for watching, and we'll see you next time for some more Let's Play Fate Grand Order, wherein we continue with interludes and all that good stuff. Uh, so we will see you then for that. Ciao.